City of Vaughan celebrating the Business Achievement Awards hosted by the Vaughan Chamber of Commerce. The most brilliant minds in the city are gathered under one roof to find 14 different winners in award categories to celebrate business leaders and entrepreneurship. Well, our charity it resides, our headquarters is in Vaughan, and uh, this is the community that has supported us for the past decade. Enormous support from this beautiful community, so it's fitting. It's, it's like we're in our hometown, right? This is our, this is our, our main headquarters here yes. in Vaughan. Well, it was a promise I made after losing my father to suicide 30 years ago. And after 20 years, I spoke the promise out loud to one person, my beautiful co-founder here, Benny Karinji. And um, he responded, let's do something together. And 10 years later, we have an incredible community of volunteers who work tirelessly. Um, and we're very proud after 10 years to have raised $750,000 for mental health programs for those that live with mental illness and those that support those living with mental illness. Maybe you should tell the story of why the hat. And when we first started, we are trying to come up with different concepts and I think Angela explained it well, especially what it means uh, with their experience and their hat. Yes. Um, so also, you know, my own story um, from uh, clinical depression. Uh, the hat really, when you're not well, you want to disappear. You want to be incognito because you're so not well. And uh, we kind of flipped the hat on its other side and said we're going to wear a hat to show those that are suffering and not well that we're with them and that they're not alone. And we wear it to celebrate. You know, we share and uh, we raise funds with the beautiful hats. That's the creative side of it. Right now, as, as I mentioned, we're third-party fundraisers, so we're really major supporters of great organizations such as CAMH, Humber River Hospital, Jack.org, What's Up Walking Clinic. So we're always looking to partner up with other uh, corporations, foundations, where our brand will allow uh, us to really deliver a message that really they can't deliver with how we use our hats for symbol symbolism for mental health. And our gala fundraiser uh, is our signature event, but we have a lot of third-party events in our honor that allow us to raise funds for those programs. So that's a, a big part of our awareness, not only the funds, but the awareness of people talking and sharing the stories at all these different types of events is really what the Hats On is all about. Well, Mr. Tony Monaco, who's one of our big uh, ambassadors, has been a big part of it, and his uh, wife Romina, and all the people that do what we call Friend of Hats On events, where they host an event in our honor uh, that allows us to have a bigger pool of money to give to our beneficiaries collective. It's all about the collective. All of us collectively being part of something greater than ourselves. I just want to add, we're just really excited. It's our 10-year anniversary this year. Our gala, October 26th, here at Universal Event Space, will be one that you will not forget. And there you have it, the Business Achievement Awards celebrating business excellence, entrepreneurship, and philanthropy, hosted by the Vaughn Chamber of Commerce. For TLN, I'm Camila Gonzalez.